basically uh, do something with the money that would become available, the $400 million, they want to send it back as a uh, 4% income tax cut. Uh, what's your thoughts on, on that proposal, or do you have other ideas in mind for what to do with that money, if anything? If that's what the amount is, and of course I'm not at all sure of that, uh, mm -hmm. but uh, if that's what the amount is, I would hope that we would be spending some money particularly and I'm prejudiced. I happen to have the privilege of serving in the Army during uh, the uh, Vietnam War. I stayed in Atlanta, Georgia, which was a, a good assignment for me. But uh, the, uh, uh, the veterans are not being adequately treated. We have tremendous problems with uh, <coughs> heroin addiction in this state. We have a lot of problems, and I think we probably look there first, and then I'm not being critical of the Senate, but I think we want to look there before we would uh, do a, a, a cut of that size. So would that be funding more funding in the from the Medicaid side, or would you create another, put more money into the Veterans Department? What are you that, about there? that we're unsure of, very frankly. We're not sure what we're allowed to do <clears throat> under the uh, under the uh, uh, permission that was given to Ohio to expand. We're, we're not positive what all is involved there, and we'll have to hold hearings. We do have people, thank God, who are very knowledgeable in this area. The governor has two outstanding people in particular. And, and uh, so, uh, obviously, we, we're going to want to hear from them in committee. Do you have somebody uh, cooking up a, a bill on that, then? Uh, I don't, maybe, I thought the heroin bill had been introduced. Uh, certainly the veterans mm -hmm. bill has been. So you're saying that mm -hmm. the money, maybe some of that money could be thrown into that bill? Yeah, we have uh, we have had serious problems in Ohio with drug addiction, as you'll recall. Uh, God bless Colonel Johnson; he brought the first bill to the floor, and, and uh, we no more than started to enforce that. And it became clear that uh, uh, what he had told us, as a physician and as someone who knew his area, was uh, was, if anything, uh, not strong enough. And uh, so since then, uh, the governor has encouraged the state patrol to be an enforcement entity there, and I think that's top shelf. Um, but uh, we now find that heroin is cheaper than the uh, legitimate uh, drugs, and uh, consequently there's a very much increased abuse of heroin.